My name is Matt Tice. I'm the clinical director with Pathways to Housing PA. So I'm a uh, licensed clinical social worker, but I'm uh, also an administrator working with all of our clinical teams at the agency. We serve probably about 400 individuals across Philadelphia. We have about 100% housing retention, which is huge. We also have seen um, that about 54% uh, of our participants are voluntarily engaging in medically assisted treatment. We have uh, multidisciplinary clinical teams that uh, include everything from social workers, um, substance abuse specialists. Philadelphia tends to have some of the purest and strongest, cheapest heroin um, in almost anywhere else in the country and very unfortunately that's driven a lot of the uh, surge in homelessness. Because of the high degree to which people are at very, very high risk of overdose and death, we're thinking through how can we um, keep, you, keep you alive and, uh, and then what other options can we offer you at that point. That has also impacted how we've been hiring our staff who we've been wanting to bring in. We want to make sure that we have people who are in long-term recovery, who have lived experience. Opioids might not necessarily be the focus for what they're dealing with, but other things do come up, and we have to still make sure that we can be dynamic and flexible in how we respond to them. All of these areas are, are things that we can look at the measures and see that, they're, that we're really making a true impact on people's lives.